who say men no day i want you to pay attention and watch this very video till the end wonderful people of biafra lovers of freedom all over the world you are welcome to biafra unite channel slash television this very moment today's date is 28th of may 2024 and i have some video clips for you Dear friends and lovers of freedom, I want you to pay very good attention to this very news, or should I say videos, because they are going to show you something very, very important I can assure you. I don't want to talk too much. I have three different kinds of videos to show you during the course of this very broadcast, so I want us to go straight to the official and verified ex-handle of the Prime Minister, Mazi Simon Ekpa, let us see what he has tweeted this very morning so the first one is this he said breaking midwestern oil company delivery line at ebedo in kwale ndokwa delta state decimated in the ongoing economic strangulation of the terrorist state the zoological republic of animal kingdom nigeria he said go and verify so this is the video clip as you can see here but because of the fire and the color i don't have to play it but the video clip is there even if you go to the official ex handle of the prime minister of the biafra republic government in exile mazi simon Epa, you are going to see the video there it's only about six seconds video and because of the color because this is pure red and of course you know the platform we are using the youtube and facebook may not allow it though this is not the main video that i want you to watch i have two clips of video the first one you already know it but i want you to watch it again when the prime minister mazi simon Eba interviewed our leader mazi namde kano there are some words that our leader said i want you to listen once again to those words used by our leader and after that i will play you the last video which is very 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 interesting i'm very very certain you wouldn't want to miss that very last video now let me show you what the prime minister said here before playing the video for you one of the videos because i have the last one to show you he said onyendu please tell them our freedom is non-negotiable our freedom is non-negotiable this is very very important word our freedom is non-negotiable so i want you to pay attention and watch this very video onyendu mazinam dekanu said our freedom is non-negotiable listen you have come uh, come this far uh what thing i'm going to ask you i think it's gonna be the last question before before i allow you to rest because you know you have been on this uh, on this journey for a very long time and every day on the phone and all that so i'm gonna ask you one last question the question is this if from what i've just read now about the motion for biafra independence at the uh the uk parliament yes the word the wording is that that the uh office of the commonwealth must make sure they use their diplomatic power ties to compel though they did not use the com the word compel but to you know uh, uh compel nigeria government to organize referendum for a possible uh freedom of biafra and this is exactly what we are all asking now if this did not happen are you ready to lead us to do anything to get the freedom of biafra yes i am going to be, i'm going to be number one to follow you yes you think we're going to live like this like a, a bunch of animals forever of course not of course not it's kind of, they, they know it very well that we are coming and i will come and i'll bring her with me they understand it very well you better give me biafra now if they do not give me biafra now the zoo I, i'm making it very clear to the whole world so they understand what i'm saying very clearly so that by the time that we are gone history will they will remember the deeds of god upon our lives we have not come for anything else i don't exist for anything else it's only for biafra to come if you're not going to give me that biafra i will destroy everything i see on my path i'm being honest with you there is no other way there is no other there is no other outcome forget about all those uh, speaking grammar and, uh, that's rubbish give us a reference 
as those British MPs tried to do, in keeping with the fact that in England you have people that have soul and country. If you have a referendum today and people say, please really vote to remain in one Nigeria, I'll give up. But that's what we're going to And nothing. You know, we, you know where we are now. You think we are going to drop our guns now? Is that what you mean? Are we going to drop it now? No. No way. You must negotiate. And that is going to be a referendum. They understand it. Or else we give them hell. And they know it. If, if Boko Haram, a bunch of PBOs that didn't go to school can give you tough time, imagine people who are educated and all over the world. But as you know, with Pharaoh, their ears will be blocked. So they'll be doing their agenda with some. They will think, oh, we have a Hanese, we have George Obion, so we have the likes of Rope, which are them, which have prevailed. But you'll hear their stories soon as well. We're not going back up. We have come to die from what we believe. Thank you very much for having me, Simon. And continue your good work. And don't allow Satan to get into you. Don't. <laughs> never. Never. Thank you very much, Ohama DK. Uh, DK Anna Bogunanya. Greetings from people from Canada. Greetings from people. Now, this very interview is what generated the greediness and envy that you see today. I don't want to analyze this interview. Maybe I could talk about it when the time comes. Not now. But I have the last video which I want to play for you. So I want you to pay attention and of course follow what I'm about to show you. Who say men no day? I want to let them know that men day. Men day. I want you to watch and see for yourself that men day this is just this is just a unit and this is just a unit a unit <laughs> just a unit within a camp who say men no day I want you to understand that what Mazin Amdekanu said is what we are doing today. Whether the zoo likes it or not, it doesn't change anything. He said that na igwa anonwa aibunigolo. The dragon flag that has been raised is not coming down except the referendum is conducted. Every single thing we are doing today is being, should I say, prophesized already by Mazen Amdekan. Hey, you may not understand it. Any carnally minded individual will never understand what is happening today. He said that the dragon flag, and the dragon flag that we have raised is not coming down anymore is not in any way coming down again until Biafra is restored. He said that they know. Mazin Amdekanu said that they know that the zoo is aware. He said that the only solution is to give us referendum or else he will bring hell to the zoo. And that is what you are seeing today. So everything we are doing is to make sure that that objective of Mazin Amdekanu, that dream, that very prophecy that God Tukokikabiyama gave to Mazin Amdekanu is being fulfilled. That is what we are doing today. And the prophecy, the dream, is to restore Biafra. If it's not to restore Biafra, nothing else. Count us, count all of us out. Anybody who is telling you any other thing is deceiving you. They say, I heard some people say they are crazy when for the past 20, 25 years we are not here for awareness we are here to restore biafra that's what we are here for we have created awareness even the awareness started already since 1999 we are no longer creating awareness anybody telling you that he or she is creating awareness as if uh, that person is the biggest fool awareness has been created 
every Biafran today is aware about Biafra. Even a two years old uh, uh, old child can tell you about Biafra. So we are not in any way creating awareness. We are fighting for our freedom. That is the reason why you see the Igwe is already up. We have raised the Igwe. We have raised the dragon flag. We are, if I now go far, you know, sakatum, sakatum. Eduki yene is in a condom in the in the rogi sakatum. Somebody in a lot somewhere now we're getting about awareness can I create? Are you okay? If I ne tifabo sakatum, sakatum, sakatum. Only thing you see on a lot sakatum. That is the only way you fight for your freedom. You don't beg your way out. You don't. You can never beg your way out. It is not possible. Nobody, no group of people beg their way out of slavery. It, it, in fact, anything like that does not exist. Do not pay attention to that. We are fighting for our freedom. We are fighting for what we believe in. And we are not going to stop until the total exit of Biafra from the damnable zoological Republic of Animal Kingdom, Nigeria. Men day. Who say men no day? Who say men no day? I want you to come over here. As you watch the video, thank you, my people. To salo no mozia and make it go viral.